everybody and welcome to a sort of haulish type of video. Um, so today I'm going to be showing you guys a very special item that I ordered from a very special person uh, in Japan. And as you guys know, I love the Pokemon Lapras. Uh, she is my favorite Pokemon in the world and I've been trying to find this specific item for like a really long time. Uh, in the United States, and unfortunately, it's really, really expensive in the United States. Um, I think it's around 75 bucks last time I checked, and that's crazy. Um, and so I decided to ask my friend who uh, lives in Japan, and I met her on Instagram. Um, I bought another plush from her, um, and I asked her if she could find me this specific plush, um, because I guess they have different... Um, like little website things in Japan as compared to like the United States and so I asked her I sent her a picture of the item and I'm like can you find this for me for like cheaper in Japan and I can totally pay you and um, you know it'll just work out like that and she you know she accepts and she goes and she searches it and she actually finds one and I have been over the moon I've been waiting a month for this um, and the website she basically got it from is this website called Mercari, and it's basically like a, a garage sale type app that you can get on your phone, and there's one for the United States and there's one for Japan. So she looked at the one in Japan and she was able to find this item, and I am just like in love right now. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can tell, but um, basically it was 1,200 yen. Which she said is basically ten dollars uh, in American money, and I'm like, oh my gosh, ten dollars? That is crazy. Because I mean, I've been trying to find it for months, and the only thing I could find is like seventy bucks, and that's crazy. I don't have seventy bucks, so I asked her, I'm like, can you buy it for me, and I can just send you, you know, the money over PayPal and shipping and stuff? And she goes, yeah, sure. And so she buys it for me, um, and. It only ended up costing me $19, which is a steal. Um, I'm very, very happy. I guess like stuff in Japan is is a lot cheaper, um, but I'm just I'm very, very happy. Um, and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. It took a month um, because the person had to ship it to her, and then she had to ship it to me. And of course, it's Japan, so it's far away. I'm not that far away from Japan actually. I'm in Washington State, so it's basically just like coast to coast. Um, but anyways guys, I'm going to show you the item. She's right here, um, and uh, here she is. I'm very, very excited. It's a Lapras plush, um, and like I said, I have other ones as well. They're over on my bed that I can also show off another video if you guys want to see another video like this, but um, this is my Lapras plush, and I'm very, very happy. Um, I've been trying to find this guy for, like I said, a couple months, and I wasn't able to find him. Um, I wasn't going to pay $70 either. I mean, I love Lapras a lot, but that's a lot of money. <laughs> um, and I didn't really trust, like, the websites either, and I knew I could trust um, this girl on Instagram because she sent me another Lapras plush. It's actually sitting on my bed right now. Um, and I'm just going to go over this guy here. So he's really, really big. Like, the other plush I got from her is, like, a little kind of keychain. And this guy... <laughs> He's really big. You can tell, like, the size of my head. He's, like, bigger than my head. It's it's crazy. But anyway, there he is. Here's his face. He has very, um, where am I going? Here we go. Like, nice embroidered eyes. Like, it's very nice. Oh, I forgot to tell him who it's made by. It's made by Ban Presto, who also makes a lot of Pokemon merchandise, which is really cool. Um, unfortunately, I think they're really only in Japan, though. So, like, if you're trying to find something, you're probably only going to be able to find it in Japan. So, um, that's why I'm very thankful that I have a really good friend <laughs> that's able to find me these things and is very, very reliable and anyways. So yeah, here's, here's his eyes. Very nice embroidered eyes with a nice little eyebrow there. His ears are very, very, um, well, actually he's kind of stitched together. It's kind of like an, an entire piece. Um, I have another Lapras that her ears are kind of like, you can actually pull them out, but these guys are actually sewn together there. Um, she has her horn, of course. Um, she has her little nostrils there. And the same side on this. And of course she has her big, giant yellow belly. Um, as well as her spots, as you guys can see, on both sides. 
of her, which are very, very lapracy. You know it's a lapras when she, they have these spots. Um, her shell is also really, really cool. Um, this one's a little flimsy, but that's okay. I don't care. Um, but there's her shell. There's her tail. There's another tag down here. I can show you guys a tag in a second. Um, but yeah, there's her shell. And she also has one of these strings on her, which I'm assuming means she was in one of those claw machines in Japan. I think that's actually where you get these um, in Japan. But I'm assuming it was probably hanging like this on a claw machine. Um, I'm just going to leave it there because it's, you know, original and stuff. Um, and then here is the tag, um, which you know is legit from Japan, Japanese writing on it there. Um, and it's not open either, you can actually open the tag, but I'm not going to open it because it's, you know, it's mint condition pretty much. But there you guys can see, it's a legit Lapras Ban Presto tag. And I am just in love, here's the bottom of her, she's very big. Actually, I'm gonna go grab the other Lapras for comparison. <laughs> um... I have a little Lapras is sitting on my bed. But this is the other plushie she sent me um, a couple months ago. The same company, but um, you can tell it's a lot, like, smaller than this guy. Like, look how small he is. Like, he's so small. So I kind of just make him, like, sit on his head, because I think it's kind of cute. Well, come on, sit on her head. There we go. So today, now it's sitting on her head. Ah! He's falling. So you guys can tell that, like, the size difference is, is crazy. Um, <laughs> but I am just in awestruck right now. This guy is amazing. Um, I want to give a huge thank you to, what was her name again? Catherine. Catherine. Um, if Catherine's watching this video, I want to give a huge thank you to her because without her I would not be able to find this guy so cheap. And I'm just, I'm so happy. Um, he's in great condition. Um, there's no, there's nothing wrong with him. And, uh, I'm just... I'm so happy. <laughs> I am going to take him on my trips. I'm going to a lot of trips this year, so um, he is going to fly with me, and we're going to go places. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let me know if you enjoyed this video by giving it a thumbs up. I really, really appreciate it. Um, and let me know, guys, what your favorite Pokemon is in the comments below, or if you have any Pokemon plushies. I actually have, um, like I said, I have this guy, and then I have a Lapras Poke doll. And then, I don't know if you guys can see, but they're like, on my bed. Maybe not. They're kind of. There's a, another keychain there, and then a Poke doll. And then you guys can't see really, but there's also a Charizard. Mega Charizard X plush up there, which I'll probably do reviews on if you guys want to see those. Um, let me know if you guys do want to see those, because I kind of like doing review videos. I think it's awesome. But anyways, here he is. I'm excited. I'm in love. Oh, I'm just in love. Anyways, thanks everybody for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. It means a lot. Let's so know that you guys are enjoying the content. And again, let me know, guys, what your favorite Pokemon is or if you have any Pokemon plushies. Because I think Pokemon plushies are amazing. Um, so yeah, thanks everybody for watching. And I'll see you guys later. Say goodbye, Lapras. Bye. <laughs> Bye, guys.